Hi, this is Bryce Waterston, the Globe Trotting Dentist. And right now I'm in Jasper National Park in the town site of Jasper. And it's just a beautiful area. Uh, Banff was beautiful and busy. Jasper is beautiful and peaceful. And uh, there are very expensive hotels here, as there are in, ja uh, in Banff as well. But there are also lovely B&Bs. And we're staying at Austrian Haven, which is about a block's walk from uh, the main street in town. And I just want to show you the care that uh, the owner, Annalise, has put into this place. This is the backyard. And there's a little pool here. Everything is taken care of beautifully and we're surrounded by mountains as we were in Banff. Mountains on all sides. It's really a lovely area. So if you're coming to Jasper I really recommend this place and it's quite reasonably priced given the competition. Well today's dental tip. It's not really a dental tip, it's a dental story. So. Once upon a time, in a galaxy far, far away. No, wrong start. But once upon a time, in the southwestern United States, um, they found there were a bunch of local residents who, who were drinking well water, and they had mottled uh, white and brown uh, spots on their teeth and almost never had cavities. So somebody got the bright idea of doing an assay of the well water, and they found there were four or five parts per million of fluoride in the well water. And over the years, what they've done is tinkered with the recommended dose for quite a few years. Uh, com uh, communities that had no fluoride would have about one part per million of fluoride added. Uh, recently, we found there were so many sources of fluoride uh, that we didn't account for, such as fluoride toothpaste, uh, you know, fluoride containing rinses, that they've lowered the recommended uh, community fluoride level to 0 0.7 parts per million. So it's been lowered about 30%. So at any rate, there are those who say that fluoride is something that was put in the water as a poison. Actually, it's naturally occurring uh, it was put there by nature, and it's, um, it's just part of, you know, our environment. So, uh, this is Buzz Waterson having a really terrific time and having a lot of trouble finding the off button on this. So, uh, sorry, I'm going to have to mess this up at the end, but have a great day.